guys today we are going to make something really interesting in scratch that is a mouse trial i know it seems so exciting to do right so it is going to be way more interesting when you do the code so let's get started first we know we need to make a main character to follow your mouse pointer so let's go to the scratch option or the menu option where you get the sprites and let's search for a star you can choose any sprite you want so i'll choose a star and let's choose a backdrop i'll go to patterns and take the stripes yes it's good so now let's go to the code first we need to make we need to make the sprite or the star to follow the mouse pointer so we have the go to random position and if we change the random position mouse pointer the star goes to the position of your mouse pointer but it doesn't permanently follow you like this so for that what you need to do is forever loop so if you see yes it is following you so we need this to happen when the green flag is clicked so we have the green flag so the first code is ready the second code is that you need to make a trial but to make the trial first you need to have a clone of the star so there is a code block called create clone of myself and so if you see it creates a clone each time you click this so yeah now we have the main code block of the second code so we again want this to happen forever so that it follows with the trial and we want this to happen on a green flag screen second code is also done now this code gives more enthusiasm to the trial why because you can add color you can add more effects and more motions in this code what you're going to do now so first let's make the uh number of clone you want for that we have repeat 10 times if you want suppose 20 clones then you can type 20 but not now let's keep it to 10 itself so now we have repeat 10 now we want it to change the color so we go to looks and then we have change color effect by 25 right now we want it to move 10 steps and then after moving 10 steps it should change the effect to um ghost effect but this is for repeat so it is going to happen together okay so we have to make the color to ghost so that it uh, gives the effect of fading away and the effect should be not too effective so let's make it to 10 so yeah we have here and we don't i usually put when green flag click for this code what we have to put as it in control it is when i start as a clone why when i start as a clone because when i start as a clone is because you are having a clone already with yourself and so if you start as a clone only you have to give this color and the ghost effect so that's why we have when i start as a clone and then there's the last code which is delete this clone why should we delete the clone you might have the question because um let me show you an example let me without to delete this clone you see it is sometimes it paints and we don't want it to paint and at the point it stops the code stops so we don't want the code or anything to stop right so we have to delete this clone and yeah done so this is your mouse pointer isn't this really fun If you don't want this fading away then you can just take the change to ghost effect. So, yep, it is full bright colors. So, this is how you do a mouse trial in scratch. It is really interesting as I told you before. So, yeah, enjoy.